Now, five years ago, the future for an East Cleveland fertilizer mine looked bleak. The Bulby mine's reserves of potash were running out, putting nearly 600 jobs at risk. However, the mine's turned itself round with a new product, which it's digging out in record tonnages. Our business correspondent, Ian Reeve, reports. At the bottom of Europe's deepest mine. Here at Bulby in East Cleveland, they're mining the fertilizer polyhalite. It's a relatively new product, extracted after potash reserves dwindled. That threw the mine's future into doubt, as well as the fate of 580 jobs. But polyhalite has saved the day. They're mining record tonnages, on course for a million tonnes this year, and sold to farmers around the world. So it was a leap of faith to, to, to get into uh, polysulfate, which which is a you know kind of a unique commodity nobody else is doing it in the world you know so so we've had to not only be able to learn how to mine it how to process it um, but but also how how do we market that you know how how do we show farmers that, that, that there's good value in this product and on the back of a viable future the israeli parent company could be persuaded to invest further here how can we economically extract that 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 mineral um, from underground. Uh, so we've done that. Uh, we've, done, we've, we've got an expanded drilling program. You know, we've, we've employed a lot more technical people here at site to ensure that we've got a bright future. And, um, you know, we're looking at that growth. James is just one of the mine's workforce who can now feel more secure in his job, which is surveying the underground seams of polyhalite. It fills me with confidence, to be fair. It fills me with confidence and, you know, it settles me knowing that I've got a job here for, for a long time if I want it. It shows it be bringing money in, you know, they'd be able to invest in me and, you know, the opportunity's there. The Bulby mine has recently won a 25-year extension of its life from National Park planners. East Cleveland gave a sigh of relief as 85% of the workforce live within a 12-mile radius of the mine. The average salary is £50,000 a year. Polly Haylight could now ensure payments for years to come. Ian Reeve, BBC Look North, Bullbeat.